So you might be in a situation where your find my option inside of your iPhone settings is disabled. Now this can happen for a couple of different reasons. The first reason why something like this could end up happening is because you have some sort of restriction set up inside of your phone. So the first thing I'd recommend doing is going to set up your particular iPhone settings like this, scrolling down until you find the screen time option, which is right here. So scroll into screen time. And then you want to go down into content and, you know, and privacy restrictions, which is right here. And you want to go down into allowed applications. So there should be a little option right here that says allowed applications. And all you want to do is you want to make sure the find my application is enabled. Or you can just go through and just completely turn this thing off. So you can just turn off content and privacy restrictions. And that will go through and pretty much fix this issue as well. If that doesn't seem to be the issue, the next thing I'd recommend doing is going through and making sure that you are signed in with your iCloud account. So go inside of your iPhone settings like this. You want to scroll into this like top portion right here. And all you're going to want to do is go into here and you want to go ahead and log in with your particular you know, Apple ID and iCloud account and all that stuff. And you want to make sure you're properly logged in because if you're not properly logged in, that is probably going to be another issue you're going to run into as well. So go through right into here, log in with your Apple ID and all that stuff. And you want to make sure that doesn't seem to be the problem. Now, if that doesn't seem to be the issue, the next thing I'd recommend doing is probably try going through and updating your phone. So right inside of your iPhone settings like this, you want to scroll down until you click into general settings right here. You want to click on a software update, which is right here. And all you're going to want to do is update your phone. So go right into here, software update your device. And all you're going to want to do is basically update your phone. And you want to see if that ends up fixing the problem. So. Those are kind of the main ways to go and do it for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.